Hello guys, welcome back to another video. And in today's video, I'm gonna be doing a tutorial, as y'all probably saw from the title. I'm gonna be doing a tutorial on Swamp. So, um, I'm pretty good at Swamp already, so I'm gonna be just doing a full tutorial on how to get better at Swamp, some routes and Swamp, stuff like that. So yeah, let's go. All right, so first thing you might see when you come to Swamp is a bunch of these trees. So all the trees, actually all of them, have a really good, like, they're really good. I don't know how to say it, but like, they're really fun to branch around. So, if you combine all of the trees and just do a bunch of branch routes and just like go from one side of the map to the other, you can basically be uncatchable if you get really good at it. The next thing I wanted to show you guys about is the vines in this map and the lily pads. So first thing I'm going to talk about is the lily pads. So lily pads are very useful in the new su er, sewer map because um how bouncy they are. So if you can just go around the map bouncing the lily pads just like this, you can get really good at it. Alright, so now also with the lily pads, you're going to want to memorize where most of them are. So, yeah, just try and memorize where most of them are. If you can't, that's fine too. All right, so the next thing I'm gonna talk about is the vines. So, you wanna, there's not too many vines in this map. So you are actually gonna wanna memorize where all of them are. Just like the little pads. So basically, over here, there is about three vines. Then you always have to remember, there's one right here. This is the only one surrounding the house. One right there. Here are these three vines, and then if you come over here, there's a vine up here. You can swing on and stuff. And there's a vine right next to this tree. There's also one right here. So after, if you're ever running away from the lawn monkey and you swing on these vines right here, after you do that, you can actually come back and swing really far. Away. So yeah, just try and memorize where all the ropes are. Alright, so the next thing I wanted to talk about is rope slapping and this glitch right here. So if you come over here near like, um, I don't know where, really where it's happening, you'll probably find it. And if you can rope slap on this rope, or if you know how to rope slap, uh, you can actually go really far with this rope, which is actually really good. Because basically how it makes you go far is that it's a rope and there's a lily pad and a lily pad's all right, and the glitch I want to talk about right here is where this is like the glitch I talk about in like Project Maple videos. If you put one of your arms underneath something and then you pull it up and hold your grip, you can actually go flying. Okay, let me, let me get it for you guys. Just like that. And you could actually almost get really close to getting on the southern map with this glitch. It's really fun. All right, on to the next thing I want to talk about. So the next thing I want to talk about is something not a lot of people know about. So it's basically called water skipping. In this map, it was made by, well, I don't really know its name, but it's like Quinapple or something. Uh, I just call him Pineapple. But yeah, um, basically how you do it is you want to just hit off of a lily pad and then just stick your arms out. So if you hit off, if you go up like this, it's not gonna work as you can see. But if you hit a more parallel to, to the water, in the lily pad, you can water skip. And I like to water skip to go from lily pad to lily pad. Just like this. Really fun. And it's really good way. It's a really good way to get away from all The next thing I want to talk about in this video is the house. So the house is actually really like useful. So it's basically like has a lot of spots you can weave in and out of. So like, you could do some routes like this, you could get off of this, go over this. And it's actually really fun to weave around in. So if you can just weave through and like the windows and stuff, it actually, 
that's gonna get pretty hard for people to tag you. Unless you, um, unless they cut you off. So yeah, guys, that's gonna be the end of today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys liked the video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe because it really helps me a lot and you can all unsubscribe. Thank you for watching. Bye.